Hello friends, welcome back to the channel. Hope you are doing well. If you are facing this error, boot device not found and you can see the hard disk error code 3F0. If you are facing this error on your HP laptop, in this video, I will show you how to fix this issue. First, turn off your laptop, press and hold the power key to switch off your laptop. Now, the first step will be you have to run hardware check. So, in HP laptop, you can use this escape key or you can use this F2 key to uh, run hardware check on your HP laptop. I will show you how to do it. Turn off your laptop and within a uh, second start pressing this F2 key. And you will see this kind of screen. You can see HP PC hardware diagnostic. So these are the options you have. Memory test, hard drive check. So you have to select the second option, hard drive check. Then press enter. Now you have two options. Uh, I will go for the first one, quick check. And you can see starting hardware check. Now wait for few minutes. And here you can see the result. Testing device one, smart check pass. So that means there is no hardware issue. That means there is no problem with my hard drive in my laptop. So the next step will be uh, you have to check your BIOS options, BIOS menu. So for this, turn off your laptop again, press and hold the power key, switch off your laptop. Now open your BIOS menu. So in HP laptop, you can use this escape key or you can use this F10 key, this one, this F10 key to open your BIOS menu. Uh, I will show you how to open your BIOS menu with this escape key. So Turn on your laptop and within a second start pressing this escape key okay like this and here you will see all the options so if you want to uh, run the hardware scan you can select this option system diagnostics f2 and if you want to open the bios menu in hp laptop you can also use this uh, f10 key to open your bios setup so i will drag uh, drop down the menu and i will select this option bios setup press enter and this is a bios menu now go to this option advance you can use your uh, mouse okay like this select this option now click on this option boot options now scroll down now you have to select this legacy boot order tick this option legacy boot order select this option then click on save then click on yes after that click on this main menu then click on this option the last option save changes and exit click on yes that's it now your system will reboot I'll wait for a few seconds and you can see the issue has been resolved my laptop is now booting this is all for the video. Thank you.